When Mindy Alexander's now three-year-old daughter, Eliana, kept getting sick, she and her husband, John, were at a loss. When Eliana was two, she had four strep infections in, in just over six months. After the last round of antibiotics, she started exhibiting UTI pains. And her pain continued for months after, yet doctors couldn't give them a diagnosis. We ended up going to our pediatrician and urgent care for about six or seven visits and everything was coming back normal and clear. It was tough to see Eliana in pain and not be able to help her. Desperate, Mindy, like most parents, turned to the internet and found Virginia-based Aperiomix, a biotechnology company that says they can help solve medical mysteries. We were very, very frustrated, upset, and just looking for answers. Aperiomix CEO, Dr. Crystal Eisenhower, helped start the company in 2014 with one goal, to help doctors and chronically ill patients figure out what's making them sick. We aim to change everything about how infections are identified. We know that there are millions of people living with chronic infections and the current system can't identify those. The tests simply don't exist. So what makes a Periomix different? They say their exclusive medical database that can identify thousands of otherwise undetected pathogens from one DNA sample. Instead of looking for one thing at a time, we're looking for everything that's known at a time. So we screen every sample for over 37,000 possibilities. If you think this sounds familiar, think again. Eisenhower is quick to shoot down comparisons to the now discredited Theranos, led by Elizabeth Holmes, who has recently been the subject of numerous films and books. We are highly trained scientists and medical professionals. We operate under very strict quality guidelines. We operate in a transparent manner, so there's really just no comparison. The company insists they don't diagnose or treat patients directly. Rather, with Eliana's test results, her own doctors were able to treat her specific strain of infection. And within a month, her symptoms were completely gone. I assume that a, a standard UTI culture would cover everything, everything that could cause a UTI. And I've since learned that's just not the case. For Eisenhower, her business is personal. I spent a lot of time with my maternal grandmother growing up, and she was always very sick. The doctors just didn't have the right tools to be able to figure out what was causing her pain. If a periomics and my team here can help other people get an answer, that's really why we're here. Today, Eliana is healthy and thriving, and her family is grateful. She's a regular three-year-old chasing her brother around and, and enjoying life. <laughs>